What's going on everybody? In today's video, we're gonna go over the best investments that in turn is gonna make you a lot of stubs. Now, we only have one, potentially, two more roster updates. So that gives you one, maybe two more chances to become a stub millionaire. If you're new to the channel, drop a like on the video. Don't be a hater your whole life. Hit that red subscribe button down below and turn your notifications on. Make sure you are subscribed for the 10K giveaway. Shout out to the MVPs and the MVP elites. Let's get into today's roster investments. If you're looking for great gaming services, head on over to AHMLB and make sure you use code FET for 5% off your order. All right, so the first card we're gonna go over is Lewis Roberts from Chicago White Sox. Over the past seven games, so these are cards that we need to monitor, especially at the price that a lot of these people are at, you can make a lot of stubs. You can see I'm at 1.4 million. If I cash out the last 30 or 40 cards that I have, I would be about 1.7, 1.8 million stubs. So this Lewis Robert right here has a potential to make you a lot of stubs for only 3,111. And if you don't want to put that number in, you can drop down to the right and put them in for about $29.95. $29.95, that's going to make you almost 11 to 1200 stubs on every single investment. And if he does get the upgrade, that's going to put you at about 2000 stub profit on each and every single investment. All these cards that I'm going over, you need to make sure that you get about 15 to 20 of them bare minimum. So you can walk away with at least 200,000 stubs up to 600 or 700,000 stubs. We have made a lot of millionaires this year over the past seven games. Lewis, Roberts has one home run, nine RBIs, and 13 hits. So he's doing about two hits per contest over the past seven games. So we're going to monitor him together. We're going to keep dropping videos over the next six to seven days. We're going to be coming back with an update on what players are performing and if you got good investments or if you need to cash them out. Already getting this card for $29.95. You can cash him out in the next four to 500 stubs upgrades. So if he gets around 40 for 4,500 stubs, you can cash them out and make a lot of profit. Next card that should have got upgraded but didn't is this Andrew Benintendi, 78 overall. You can get them for only 189 stubs. You can get them for a little cheaper than that using the method that I showed you. But over the past seven days, he has seven RBIs. He has no home runs, so he's not swinging for power, but he has 12 hits over the past seven games. He's betting a 500 with an OPS of 1,102. So if he can keep that up the next three to four games, he should be considered at getting that plus two. A lot of people got plus threes and plus fours on the last roster update. So keep your eyes locked on this Andrew and see how he performs over the next three to four games. Another card that has been performing over the past week is this Frank Swindle at only 300 stubs. You can also get them for a little cheaper. You can put in the order for about 278 stubs, put in about 10 or 15 orders like that. Frank Swindle over the past seven games has two home runs, five RBIs and 11 hits. So he's on pace to be averaging about two hits per contest over the past week. If you can keep that up over the next three to four games, depending on if they keep the roster update exactly two weeks from now, or if it gets pushed back one more time, it could be the last one. It might be one more after that, but he only needs a plus two. He is on pace to do big things. Tyler O'Neill, 84 overall, didn't get the upgrade last time. So this is something that you need to watch out for at only 2,800 stubs, still a very cheap investment. Make sure you go out and get yourself a bunch of these you can get them for about 27 35 and you can go get about 15 of them 27 35 you got a chance to make double profit even going off a of hype tyler o'neill over the past seven games has four home runs nine RBIs, a 375 betting average, and nine hits. So over the past seven games, four home runs. He hits for a little bit more power. Drop a like on the video if you enjoy these videos. If y'all rocking with me, you know I got y'all. Let's go.